lot of snakes they give birth. Come on, we have a job to do. We have a job to do. Here, all these uh, fossils and uh, stones, they have done their job perfectly to keep the equilibrium of the planet Earth for the common good. And then they died. They kept this atmosphere without poison, these creatures. This is all carbon. This is all called carbon, all these bones. They have taken carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. These bones take it, reduce the carbon dioxide. So these animals play in a role. Stones they explain beautifully. There are only three stones, igneous rock, sedimentary rock, metamorphic rock. You see, this is born out of fire, volcanoes. This is formed under the water. Different elements, they cement together and they form a rock. It grows bigger and bigger and bigger. Half of the rocks on planet are sedimentary rock, built by water, lakes and oceans. This is the, that rock, this rock, goes deep inside the uh, uh, planet Earth when earthquakes come. It falls down. The pressure and heat transform the same rock into metamorphic. The same igneous rock beautifully reorganizes the crystals and become a metamorphic rock. So when you know that, you can make theology, you are rock on this rock. You can make a lot of theology out of it. The Lost Paradise of Happiness, my book, the last chapter you read it, I have written on rock. I call it geology to theology. In this topic, I have discussed. So at last, it is called weathering. That is the word you should learn. Soil is made by weathering. Weathering means through water, the small particles are out. Through wind, particles are out. Through this uh, roots, they break the stones and make the soil. But I can show you right there, ants are making soil and termites. They go and grind this rock, go inside and up, they make soil. To make one inch of soil takes 10,000 years. We have got only six inch of soil, made over 60,000 years. We are taking and making a break out of it. That is our dysfunctionality. Look at that. Those are all brown gold. I call it a gold. Exactly gold you value. Imagine your civilization, those have plenty of gold, but no soil. For them, this is a gold, a brown gold. Can you grow food on a gold? No, no. you can grow food on soil. So it's called brown gold. So here, it is a mystery. It is a being. It has a personality. This has a personality. It is a being. Don't think that is something dead. It has got its own consciousness. Every rock knows everything, but they are humble. Shakespeare wrote beautifully, Sermon in Storm. Sermon in Storm. That means it has got wisdom. It is a library book. One stone has information more than sacred art library itself. You can, if you take the elements and these are you can write volumes and books. It tells the history of our planet because they are the first beings appeared on planet Earth. And they made soil. Soil made us. Soil made everything. So, Jesus Christ is the firstborn of all creatures. I think he is rock. We know that. He is the foundation for the church and foundation for every existence on planet Earth. And I think everything flows from there. And passion, death and resurrection. This Pidia. weathering, when it makes a soil, passion, death happening, but resurrection is the soil. So their resurrection happens, grass is the resurrection. We eat it, we experience resurrection. So every form of universe can be interpreted at last to PDR. The whole universe is permeated by PDR. So I think geologists, you have done a beautiful job. Congratulations. Excellent. So I want to give uh, all the three groups, well, anyway, 99.9%. <laughs>